The NASCAR Cup Series playoff race at Charlotte Motor Speedway on Sunday delivered a high-stakes battle, with Kyle Larson securing victory at the Bank of America Roval 400 and guaranteeing his place in the next round of the playoffs. However, the event took a dramatic turn when Alex Bowman, who initially appeared to advance, was disqualified after failing a post-race inspection. Larson's win at the Roval, a hybrid road course and oval track, was his sixth victory of the season. The win not only brought Larson another checkered flag, but also solidified his place in the next round of the 2024 NASCAR Cup Series playoffs. Christopher Bell followed closely behind Larson, finishing second. With the win, Larson became one of the eight drivers to continue competing for the championship, joining William Byron, Bell, Ryan Blaney, Chase Elliott, Denny Hamlin, Tyler Reddick, and Joey Logano. However, the excitement of the race was overshadowed by the disqualification of Alex Bowman. Bowman had initially placed himself among the eight advancing drivers, but after his number 48 Hendrick Motorsports Chevrolet failed a post-race weight inspection, he was disqualified. NASCAR's managing director, Brad Moran, explained that Bowman's car did not meet the minimum weight requirements. Teams are allowed a small weight margin, but Bowman's car exceeded this limit, resulting in the disqualification. As a result, Bowman's points were largely erased, dropping him below the cutoff for playoff advancement. Hendrick Motorsports had the option to appeal but declined, releasing a statement expressing disappointment. They acknowledged the infraction and accepted responsibility, recognizing that while the weight discrepancy was unintentional, it was avoidable. This disqualification handed an unexpected playoff opportunity to Joey Logano, who moved into the eighth and final spot in the next round. The race itself saw exciting battles and strategic plays, with Larson dominating the final stage to secure his victory. Throughout the race, playoff contenders vied for position and points, with Bowman, before his disqualification, taking stage two. Meanwhile, Tyler Reddick, who had faced early struggles, mounted an impressive comeback in the final laps, pushing himself back into the championship contention. As NASCAR fans now turn their attention to the upcoming race in Las Vegas, the stakes are higher than ever, with only eight drivers left in the chase for the championship. Larson's victory and Bowman's disqualification have added an unexpected twist to the season's narrative, proving once again that in NASCAR, anything can happen on and off the track. Stay subscribed for more videos.